I've actually already heard things are not good with Kyle. Who's Kyle? Wow, who's Kyle? Okay, so you are like the b below deck gossip. Let's be honest, Kyle. I have no idea what she's talking about. Kyle, is it your fault, the drama in the interior? Because you did spill the tea about that text. Mm -hmm. Are you to blame for all of the interior conflict? I think looking back at that and seeing what I what's gone through is I was only protecting my best friend right. by saying, you know, there's a lot of overreaction from your side. I know what, what could happen as a consequence. Bring it back in. Okay. So that is my warning. And then it was taken out of context and blown against me. So the lessons I learned is, you know what, let people burn their own fire and I'll yeah. just be out to watch it and have yeah. some s'mores, you know? So are you and Natalia best friends? Absolutely not. I just heard from Kyle that things might not be going well between you two as the season comes to an end. What do you have to say about that? There's one person to blame in that situation and it's all him. Okay. Can you tell us like what happened? Are you guys friends now? Are you going to speak at BravoCon today? We are definitely not friends and we will not be, um, but yeah, I think he caused some drama intentionally and I think he purposely tried to sabotage my season. But what did Kyle do to you? I still don't know who Kyle is. Okay. It sounds like we are anti-Kyle on the Below Deck team. Are you anti-Kyle? I'm never anti-Kyle. Okay. What I am is Kyle needs to correct himself. Sometimes Kyle's an awesome human being. He just doesn't know when to close it. Mm -hmm. And I think sometimes he thinks he has to do that, maybe for TV, mm -hmm. and he does it because Kyle is a gentle soul mm -hmm. and he means well, okay. but his mouth just takes over. Yeah. Sometimes you gotta filter that. We don't always have to say what we're thinking. That's true.